out of the city. The Combine's not making it easy. We're trying to get enough people together to force our way through to the train station. People are meeting up in a safe house nearby. Can you take us there? You bet. Let's go. This way. It's me. Open the door. What's the password? I'm not even gonna tell you to shut up. Come on in. Previously, certain protein chains important to the process of embryonic development were selectively prevented from forming. This is no longer the case. Your for those daughter, so right? inclined, now would be an excellent time for procreation. Which is to say, in layman's terms, you should give serious consideration to doing your part for the revival of the species. We must make the most of the time we have, as it is by no means certain how much time we have secured ourselves before the Combine attempt to restore their dominion, as they certainly shall. Since this is, in fact, the first opportunity we have had to speak openly of the baleful influence of the Combine, there is much ground to cover. And, in fact, I hope to institute a series of useful bulletins in the days ahead. However, for now, we will have to content ourselves with some relatively meager exposition. The destabilization of the City 17 reactor has had repercussions that were not entirely unexpected. Although we hardly dared speak this whole time, Help! the destructive pulse forced a Let's find another way the entire up. network of linked Citadel reactors. Thus, for the time being, I believe that all combined forces have failed completely, as well as all communications systems based on that technology. In short, the combine are completely cut off. Combine forces currently stationed on Earth are now isolated units, stranded. However, this is most likely a temporary state of affairs. <laughs> as they poured through in greater and greater numbers. In addition to the completely xenotheric species, there are many modified post-human allies still remaining on Earth who will be doing their utmost to re-establish the future of the the past decade. We have made several technological advances which have been of the Combine's return. We continue to diligently assemble and train a new generation of scientists and For what the Combine fear the most is not any tangible human weapon, but our will, our intellect, our ability to respond selectively and rationally. 
reaction to every terror they turn against us. We place our firmest hope in the human spirit, even knowing how easily it may be shattered. I blame Odessa. We have all seen friends and family I crushed never guess by the combine. One time. Some what of our neighbors idiot. have allowed themselves to be co-opted and purged of their humanity by the military machine. And those who resisted have met a most terrible fate. Still, I cannot overstate how important it is that we retain our humanity. Only this will allow us to hold together as we must for their inevitable return and what is certain to be unimaginable retaliation. And, uh, oh yes, if you missed any part of this message, loop repeatedly until... Scarcely time to record, let alone rehearse. What's that, Eli? Oh, right. This has been Dr. Isaac Kleiner, formerly of Black Mesa. Gordon! Alex? I don't believe it. How the hell did you get out of the Citadel? We're not exactly sure. All I know is the Vortigaunts had something to do with it. But what about you, Barney? I'm doing okay, just going crazy trying to- They found us! Aw, oh, hell, Gordon, were you followed again? We stole some information from the Citadel on our way out. I don't know what it is yet, but it's important enough that they've been hounding us the whole way here. Well, put the pressure on We gotta get moving. You guys know about the evacuation trains, right? Yeah. Yeah, well, we've been planning to make a push on the train station. Now it looks like we're gonna have to cut a path through every chicken ship metro cop who's having second thoughts about defending City 17. If Gordon and I took a separate route, we could draw the Combine away from you. That'd give you a chance to get the trains filled up before we get there. Really? Well, if you say so. Now, come here, look over here. Okay, across this bridge, over the rooftops, is a safe path to the station. You two head that way. I'll hit the streets and round up everyone who's been waiting. We'll meet you there. Sounds good. Let's go. Hey, Gordon, before you go, I was getting tired of carrying this around. Listen, I don't have many more of these, so try not to lose this one, okay? <laughs> go on across, Gordon. She's waiting for you, you lucky dog, you. Gunship.
Keep an eye out for medical supplies. 